Now that you have a newborn, you're going to hear a lot of this. And it's important for you and your baby's caregiver to remember that crying is baby's way of communicating. Baby may be hungry, too hot, too cold, need a diaper change, have a tummy ache, or just want to be held. What you never want to do is shake your baby. And you'll want to make sure no one else does either. Thousands of babies suffer from brain damage, blindness, or even death as a result of what's called shaken baby syndrome. Shaken baby syndrome involves shaking a baby by the shoulders, arms, or legs. A fit of frustration can cause a parent or any adult caregiver to shake an innocent baby. Just one shaking episode can result in bleeding in and around the brain, causing permanent neurological problems or death. Never, never shake a baby. Babies are more susceptible to shaking baby syndrome because their heads are larger than their bodies and their shoulder and neck muscles are weak. When a baby is shaken, the head whips back and forth, slamming the brain against the skull, causing bruising, bleeding, and swelling inside the brain. Shaking a baby can cause injuries like blindness, mental retardation, seizures, cerebral palsy, hearing loss, paralysis, broken bones, speech or learning disabilities, and even death. Even rough handling or hitting can cause similar injuries. Babies are an amazing gift, so remember, never, never shake a baby. If your baby is crying, it's important to be a patient parent and see what your baby needs. Remember, crying is your baby's way of communicating. First and foremost, stay calm. Then you should try seeing if baby is too hot or too cold. Check baby's diaper. Feed or burp your baby. Offer baby a pacifier or toy or simply hold your baby. You can also try taking baby to a quiet room. Hold baby to your chest and walk or rock gently. Take baby for a ride in the car or stroller. Put baby in a swing. But never, never shake a baby. Babies cry, and if your baby's crying bothers you, take deep breaths and count to 10 slowly. Call a friend or relative to talk. Exercise nearby. Listen to music. Read a magazine or book. Ask for help. Remember, sometimes babies cry no matter what you do. Lay the baby down on his or her back in a crib. Go to another room. Give yourself a short break. Be sure to go back and check on your baby in five or 10 minutes. No matter how tired, angry, or frustrated you feel, you must never, never shake a baby. If you think you might shake your baby and need help, call 1-866-243-BABY. If you think your baby has been shaken, stop, calm down, get help. Go to the closest hospital emergency room. Signs and symptoms of shaken baby syndrome include irregular, difficult, or no breathing, extreme crankiness, seizures or vomiting, tremors or shakiness, limp arms and legs, no reaction to sounds or acts lifeless, difficulty staying awake. Remember, never, never shake a baby is an important message to share with any person who's caring for your child, like a relative, friend, or daycare provider. Also, be sure to share the Never Never Shake a Baby brochure with everyone who cares for your child. After all, you're a parent now, and this innocent tiny person depends on you. And it's your responsibility to make sure he or she grows up in a safe, loving environment.